Hey all this and also send my back and it's probably gonna be this now and for today and stuff that so yeah. But death blow with him with Barrett. It would be nice to have Barrett show too by the way for this boss and stuff that, but yeah. Most of them will use pack to go to me when they die by the way. I'll start that too, which is nice. Keep in mind also we are all gonna put Barret in back row by the way, so yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. Just a just in case. How long have we spent now? Uh, we have spent probably over 8 hours, yes. It's not that bad of a time, uh, to be honest. Considering like both of these two and this two is very short. Uh, uh, Normally I would want to get the kills with Claude here and stuff like that, but we are doing this for reason here. Uh, because I want to focus on the armor here, here because that's what matters more basically at this point. We don't have any tranquilizers right now. Shot too. And this is the correct way, by the way, to not go into the desert properly and stuff like that if you go to the right here. And it's on this screen, by the way, where you can get the encounter that we need to stuff like that. You can just go to the correct place to the north there, but this is where you want to get the encounter, by the way. Uh, the death class as well. I think they have a good steel, right? I forgot what their steel was. Oh, yeah, platinum bangles. You can get more platinum bangles here. So you can take to save a bunch of money if, uh, and stuff like that. But actually, it's very nice to be able to just take platinum bangles here. Um, right. And there's an instant steel as well. Seemingly. Uh, I want to check what they can cast, I forgot here if it's... Right, they have laser. Uh... Wait, is it the worst enemy skill? That you have a new skill right there. Yeah. Biggest shot. But uh, I kind of forgot about that actually. So what's that? That's uh, two more. Uh, two more. Uh, Two more platinum bangers, so now we have three more, which is nice. Uh, I kind of forgot about later though, damn it. I mean, I still think you learn it even if you equip two, so we used the equip transform here and used the equip the other end of the skill. Because you will still get it right, even if you get hit by Mathematic right, because one is empty. Right, I hope. Putting the stuff on Barrett is not the greatest idea, to be honest. There is another encounter we want, by the way, and stuff as well. 
Oh, we're gonna steal more platinum bangles if we can, yes. Uh, stop that. This is an old man, what we manipulate here. Uh, any point though, to be honest here. I'll stop that. To see laser mathematic that's what happens because of that. Yeah it's really bad. Uh, yes I could just use split out on the two characters and stuff that but you know so we can go with cover and shoot below here instead of Barrett uh, Fire. We'll move one more transfer materials of course here. Uh, 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 meow, 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 meow. What this case is that has it because it's a uh, case it's just one way to manipulate. Depends if we're gonna wanna start using platinum bangers on more characters and stuff like that, but yeah. Uh, t -t 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 back in back row though, uh, I would have loved to tranquilize up here, but we cannot. I thought about the good mates with us actually. So let's fight time. Let's fight the diamonds there. Is that you? Do we steal from him once and see? Nah, he doesn't have anything. It would have been cool. I always thought that, you know, it would have been cool if. You could have gotten his arm as an actual weapon and stuff, that would have been cool, you know. Because of course he uses stuff like Molotov Cocktail, but not as like, the, the items in the game, except there is no Molotov Cocktail in the game, there is an item called Molotov, but still, you know. Marlene is still alive. Right 
In the next area, by the way, there, are, there is a great encounter in Cosmo Canyon, by the way. And later on, uh, uh, there is a snake encounter that has like five snakes, I think it is. It's really good. Now, we could just go back all the way to to the Mithril Mines and stuff like that, and do the grind there for Claude to get his first and kills and stuff like that. He does not have a Klim Hazard yet, though, so that's a bit of a problem as well. But of course you can still earn Klim Hazard after you have got the like Meteor Rain and stuff like that. And here you pick up the Rama material course as well. This is interesting, like why the heck is Rama in the Chocobo Racing place? Like it's Rama. <laughs> Rama is a fan of watching Chocobo. Or is it supposed to be that it's Joe's material actually or something like that? By the way, it appears whenever one has gone in here, basically, you basically want to approach the exit here, or the entrance. Once they're all in. Boom. Oh. There we go. Uh, yeah, I got it. Oh no, we're not recovering anything! Oh no, what would we do? It is quite right to like increase speed. I think. You can actually win with this by the way without doing the trick to hold in the balance, you know. make sure I know that you can win otherwise without doing it you know you can hold square for the most of the part no, but yeah.
I think also right that the one that calls you is different depending on your party members, right? Uh so I'm not embarrassed, uh Not on all of them right back, but, but this is really where Sina Beta gets, gets useful, by the way. And oh, and we also had a Vanada Shinra omelet, by, or Silver omelet, by the way. So we could use Silver omelet on someone instead of Sina Beta, and let's use it on Tifa then. Uh, because it's the same as the uh, Sina Beta and stuff like that, of course, yeah. Now, of course, we are gonna be able to actually get a bunch of black and gold omelets and stuff uh, like that once we reach a certain point. Uh, normally, though, I would get a column here at this point and stuff like that. Uh, I don't know if we can survive an column at this point. I think we're actually too low. Level a bit, but we can go back there later to get the aqualung and stuff that. You don't need to get it right away. Attack. Stone stack. Keep in mind that you don't become stone immediately. There's a 30 second countdown for it. Someone here. 
And you can still not steal from them, by the way, because imagine, right, if you could steal here already. Now, the thing is, of course, I always used to think that this has to do with, like, killing them both at the same time to get both of the items here, because there are two weapons technically you can get here, I think. Maybe there's only one weapon that you get here. I forgot. I was used to think that I read somewhere that that the only way you get like the two stuff that you're doesn't matter what you choose there, it doesn't give you positive points or negative points with anyone. But yeah, so Claude wants to pop bloom here, we wanna pop bloom. And then we wanna start off with the armor here. I'm gonna cast another bolt boom by the way. We do have some mega disease by the way in worst case scenario here. Yeah, no more no, no, bolt boom here. Uh, they did quite a lot of damage though, uh, which is important to remember. Uh, yeah. Uh, Tifa is gonna kill all. Uh, I probably should have left him in the back row here, by the way. You can see that. Right, I am doing some damage with my regular attacks. We will probably back row them soon, though. Tifa's uh, um, position in the back row. I think it's sometimes it's really scary to be back in the front row to start another battle and stuff like that. Cat, meow. <laughs> if you would put them in the right order. Put uh, the also in the back row. Oh, that's a bit scary, uh, Yeah, we're gonna have to really kill all the summons. Uh, yeah, the thing is, normally here, you are meant to use a bunch of enemy skills here and stuff that. So they can't expect you to go back and get them a little, little bit more power up here. Oh, don't tell me they will use that little difference there. I thought that would be alright. I think that means that I got them both. But we will see because otherwise you will only get one thing here. Fucking game. See, you need to defeat both of them at the same time there. Why is there a quit button there so, so close? Oh, that was a requit. No, it wasn't. It's just pressing the wrong button there. It's a weirdo because that's where you're supposed to get one of the staffs, basically. So, with the staff, and then it's. Why is there a staff? <laughs> and stuff that, but you can also get it in. But because I remember there are like two items you can get them, you can get one of the weapons there and stuff that. But it's not like a guarantee or anything with that. There's nothing new today, you can see. I think at least. Like I don't know everything you see, by the way, but yeah, but I know the majority of good like armors and weapons and stuff that. Healing wind. Am 
much fun to record. Oh, okay. That's good. Because keep in mind for the lost, lost numbers fight, we really want to have uh... Our attack seems pretty, pretty weak at this point though still. for the healing though is pretty pretty decent so uh, I mean our HP plus will like, have double growth as well you know it's important yeah and the reason why you go here is to pick up Titan which is completely missable except will not be miss missable because you can go back here and come later on and uh, destroy you this is not just one that I'm appreciate This is when you start finding a lot of huge interference of that. Let's go. Because that basically uh, that they give you a hint there, oh you only get Yankee materia from Yankee reactors. Which is supposed to be that this is a piece of materia there and stuff that, that that's how you get the hint that you're supposed to press something here. Titan materia. They like escalate very quickly of course in the damage that they do, but you can still see that there's still the lowest tier. Of stamina, like all of these are in the same tier. The way I consider the tiers to be on something, for example, as long as their stat increases are like the same and stuff that. But if you see, for example, on fire here, on heal, on on seal, on transform, on poison, on quake even and stuff that, uh, restore, all of these are the same, right? But then when you check revive, revive is of course the next tier because there's magic plus two, but then it's more negative into strength and also into vitality and more negative into the max health and stuff like that. Of course Titan is not not necessarily bad or anything in the whole of that because they are uh... now technically we don't technically need to fight this by the way if we don't want to I think it's weak to bolt though. But we can also start grenading stuff actually to kill stuff quickly because I mean there's no other points to the grenades at this point. This is also a guy that you can farm later on when you get morph and stuff like that. But you don't want to farm it immediately when you get morph, uh, you want to actually farm it later at the point. Because you can farm power sources from this guy. And the best kind of way to farm, by the way, sources is just to uh, do a setup that uses. Uh, I think you need to have two morph uh, materials though for it to work. Setup that I'm thinking of. So, why do we have manipulated if we don't have the enemy skill thing? Uh, like, let's remove Ramer, let's remove Epic here. Uh, equip an enemy skill, however. Earth, I could bend a muscular teeth. Keep a locomog and then we equip. Uh... Uh, 
Ah, ich finde jetzt nicht wie viel zu groß. Ich dachte, wir haben dann just so ein bisschen einfach an den USGD, also für den Pro Mathematik, Laser Matt. Was ist das? I think we're not gonna use them so it doesn't really matter how much stuff we get and uh, stuff like that, okay. But there are also cause now we can get like a big guard, we can get Aqualung and stuff that. Uh, we wanna pick up that blow here as well. Uh, that blow is gonna become really important and stuff like that because that blow is a big part of damage. Stuff like that, but we don't... But we are not gonna abuse, you know, Tifa and stuff like that, so... Uh, Oh, this broke some guy, uh, some manipulate. There is no Kappa equipment in this. Like I said, another Final Fantasy, but yeah, but that blow is instant material, of course, because the death blow much like well, with steel material is is also 40,000 and stuff that. And it gives you one plus luck. So this is where the whole percentage there becomes really important and stuff that because because the higher that st stat is, the higher you have a chance to hit with death blow and the more damage you can can deal with death blow as well. A room reactor? And I forgot which one gives you negative points here with the girls and stuff like that. So, uh, get white microphone here. So here's the thing, both white megaphone and the black megaphone is weaker. Than the yellow megaphone, by the way. Uh, nothing in particular. The next portion there, uh, need room though. Pay up. 80 gil is worth it. And this might be when we. I mean, we could use Stella Pounds of Gear, like having that whole completionist sake of keeping certain gear doesn't make much sense, in my opinion, and stuff like that. Which mean, meant that we kind of wasted money. Oh yeah, and this is where you can get it, right? Yeah, we can get with fine time already at this point. Uh, which these two are super important, so these two you just need to pick up right away. Uh, so, sell two, buy potions. Uh, potions not worth anything there, so we keep that uh, impaler. Oh, that's worth 250. Uh, sell that. Uh, uh, cannonball, ultimate scissors, diamond pin, uh, striking staff, female. Uh, sell for carbon bangle, keep two shinabetas. Get a fury ring. Oh man, do we go for more fury rings? It's always a question. Now, so here's the thing, right? So now we have some really, really. So time allows us to his up and up. This is also second tier. Uh, oh man, so this used as the other one is. It's very quick. Mr. Five is nice because that can cause confusion and berserk. And stuff like that. This is good. And of course, also here, when you check the accessories here, you can check that they have both headband, stop and they have talisman, they have white cape, and stuff like that. But yeah, but fear ring is a really important thing here, but yeah. But you meet the fight opponents to, to confuse them more. Because, and then we see, of course, the sleep and then silence. And some of them are nice for the added effect, of course, because there are also going to be certain of the effects that are pretty good. Uh, bio, bio weapons. And here you can get the hard edge, grand staff, to make you can you see the, the diamond pin there. That, that's the same as the those things, but yeah. 
but we got the course one before. We could get the boomerang here, but there's absolutely no point to doing that. You can get body pills here and shovel and molotovs as well. So, yes. so leaving ourselves with 11,000 now. Uh, there's the fuel ring, by the way. Uh, the fuel ring, though, by the way, is an absolute beast because it puts you automatically in berserk. And for certain characters, that that's actually very good because. Uh, because uh, certain characters, uh, for example, their dexterity is, is what depends your ATB gauge pretty much is determined by dexterity, but it also can affect your crit and your like, defense percentage. Uh, so you can see, even with ones that are supposedly zero, right? Because you can see here, it's zero on the defense percent on the platinum bag and on the beta, for example, and stuff like that. Um, but yeah. This is why she has 10% there. But here's the thing, the defense percentage allows you to dodge basically physical hits. And the higher the percentage, of course, the more you can dodge. Which is nice. But yeah. We're gonna buy more of your rings there eventually and stuff like that, but we're go we're go gonna go with one so far. And stuff like that, so yeah. Now if I remember correctly though, the man you can get some. Cheap tranquilizers here and cheap uh, pipers here. Nah, no, no, no. I don't want to waste a bunch of money now uh, because we're only at 11,000 now, which is pretty bad. You travel, hey, wait, they're going to all hold your shoulder. Well, you're right, don't know that his name is Zack. What's the point with T4? It was one or what's I could do. This is just an item shop. And then it was the inn over there as well. Uh, so which is nice because time of course makes it so that that's our way to get basically get the time stuff, spells, and stuff like that, like haste. We know we get access to our vehicle again. Uh, do we? We don't have anything. Oh, right, technically we can do this now. Uh, you can see you can equip white megaphone. So you can see it's just one attack weaker, but it's one or two there, so technically that's pretty good as well. Get big guard, yeah, we probably do uh, go and get the big guard now. 
What do you put on the ground rings? Oh, I'll watch them in the cap team in. This is a bit of a waste here, I forgot. Nothing to steal, can you? Here, but that was from the Quake spell because, of course, the Shinra bit has, has cinematic defense, which is super scary, actually. Ho ho, back to the Tifa again. Now, technically, I only had this set up because of the whole. Uh, because of having to go to or having to face off them because of that. Now, I don't know if that's to do with having to have the girls in your party or whatever, but yeah. But if I would have spread out the damage more there, then we would have been fine and stuff like that, so yeah. Uh, but... We need to... To... Uh, I do have the long range on her, yes. I'm gonna put those in the back row. So we have enemy skin, let's give me the And it's at the beach here. I think it is right for this beach. Because it's the beach plug enemy that we need. So uh, that's not the correct enemy. But we can get a bunch of kills here with the uh, e character. Normally I want to start setting this up properly and stuff like that, you know. Oh, I thought that was enough damage. I think one more is enough. Yeah, let's try with Chocomon and see if that's enough actually. Oh. Now the thing is we don't need the kills with her and specifically, but the thing is just that this battle is just good for, for other reasons as well. Lighting level up there as well, uh, which is nice. Then we used to this and we used to change like that with, with eyes. Uh, I mean, technically, we could replace lightning now with the earth uh, here. No poison because we got poison next. Then earth next. Because all of these should be the same amount of warp here that you need basically. So what the writing is that 2000 basically on the total. Now it's more. It's way more. Uh, for poison and earth as well. So come on, just very close to getting a... Uh, I think it might actually be on the other side there and stuff like that, but I think that we... Or is it closer to Costa del Sol? It might be closer to Costa del Sol than Calder, I'm thinking of. So there are these beat plug enemies, by the way. The beat plug enemies, uh, you will see them yet. There we are. So manipulate. Right. 
do put them in the back are alright. Maybe I should have put it on my character or whatever. I forgot what effect manipulate chance. Kate is very good at manipulating though, and I don't know why if it's just something you're meant to do with Kate. But if Kate is used as a higher chance to manipulate. Because I always thought that was the case there. But I think it might have to do with level as well. I want to test this level. Nothing to stick with. Okay, and uh, no, I'm still big guard. See here, uh, we love big guard, uh, but we're not gonna be using it, of course. Uh, we don't have any all attacks except for on her. Oh man, we don't have it on. Uh, let's see if Yokomo gets enough death blow. Boom! Guard and laser on that one, and we have uh, big guard, flamethrower, automatic on this one. And now what we need to do is go and pick up. Uh, we need to go and pick up the. Uh, now we go and pick up uh, if we can survive it right. Uh, but I don't know if that is the case or not. Uh, if we can at this point, if our HP is high enough. And of course it would be, be nice to unequip the one with the thing, but yeah. I feel ring is a bit dangerous to use, especially if you are gonna, you know, more if you're facing something that can counter attack and stuff like that. I just wanna see if he can. So yeah. So there's an enemy here that can cast Aqualung and stuff that, which can do a lot of damage of course. Normally you tranquilize yourself here and stuff that, but we don't have any. Uh, keep in mind that you can technically end Quell press on there again, if you really really want to. That's the guy! Uh, do we need to manipulate you or are you gonna start with Aqualung? No, we're not. Okay. I used the antidote him first. I wanted to, to select seal here all to see. I just want to see what this thing is first. The good, the, that's a smart combo by the way. That you can steal and then you, you, you can keep him in manipulate forever. As long as you don't do damage. I want to check to right because I don't know that all of the items that you can steal and stuff that. I know. I think this can might have had uh, something pretty decent to yeah, so, Oh, strike it! Huh? Okay, that's another. They could stack himself. Back along! Chip? That's a lot of damage! Blade! Blood? Yeah, okay. That's one shot too. You don't want to be scared. <laughs> Aqualung is to make the face here. Yeah, Aqualung is also very, very powerful. So if you go in or shake here on enemies, for example, pick all 56, add barrier and barrier haste to everybody. Every other, this basically that's, that's technically casting wall from a uh, material we don't have yet, and then casting haste. And if we go in on, and we have time, then we have haste, so on top of that. So it's the combination of the time material, it's the combination of the wall uh, or 
ba barrier material. Because Barry has both barrier and barrier and a wall, but wall is on, on the third star and stuff like that, so uh, that is uh, very, very crazy to think about. Yes, said Aqualung is big goddess 56, this is 16, uh, Aqualung is 34. Which 34, by the way, that matches uh, Ifrit in Mbekost. Except that Aqualung slaps in terms of damage. Uh, we haven't learned any other enemies this right now. That still wasn't enough for Claw though. Most of that was just a bit odd. Uh, there is one more thing we're gonna do, I think. We have enough time, yes we do have enough time to do this one, so we're not gonna make it to Cotton Canyon by the way, uh, sadly, because I wanna check just. So we're gonna set up a save here by the way. Oh shit, please don't pop us, please don't pop us, please don't pop us. I've seen these two guys be, be absolute bullshit with, with the active one. At one point, both of them like uh, both of them used the death move immediately and stuff like with their cards and stuff like that. I've seen that happen, you know. I'm guessing technically right that they hadn't thought about this yet, but technically, if you think about a lot of her staffs, technically, Yuna gets them. And that makes sense, right? Yeah, Eric is great and Eric can still hit on and stuff that too. Uh, yeah, Claude of course will still do a lot of damage because of uh, having... Well, he doesn't have long range, yeah, I put long range on her instead. But yeah, her talk and more level up. Which is nice, because that gives you two more, uh, two, uh, two more uses. But now we save outside here. Because this is basically so we can load this file here. Uh, I thought about not saving here, but it's just that that I wanna go in and check if things have changed yet, by the way. Uh, I also wanna check if I'm still here. Uh, I'm not gonna sell anything right now, but yeah. Uh, or except we can sell the uh, because striking the staff is just, that's the one that we stole right from the ghost, yeah. So you can, if you miss the train graveyard, still get it there and stuff that. I don't know with how many things that is true for. If you miss a staff, if there's somewhere else you can see hard edges and stuff that. Welcome to the Golden Sausage and the Sausage. One. So yeah, uh, yeah. Because I just wanted to carry immediately what's what's available. What's available in the battle? In, we're, we're gonna almost check out the square, by the way. And the reason why we want to check out here, and you can see now things have already changed here. So now uh, we're not gonna get blocked here. No, that's still the same. That has not changed yet. Uh, your rewards are not different right yet. Not yet. And keep them of course later on when you get here. I forgot at what point if it was upgrades of the Temple of Ancients or whatever, or if it's just after you get the Tiny Bomb Go, whatever it is. But yeah. I want to see though if. if Uh, 
the monster calls you win eight times, you get to do the thing here. Oh yeah, you cannot check here yet. Until you have actually gotten points here. Is Cloak strong enough to use kill one, right? Because we're... We're not doing this for anything, by the way, here. We're just, uh, we're just uh, doing it. I'm not doing a setup or anything. We're just gonna get... They get one fight, get points basically, we just need to win one fight. And I also want to check what the enemies are here, and stuff that, because we're doing all setup now. See, like, yeah, super easy enemies, and we're bringing the beginning here, right? No way! The 10 battle points, see, we only need the battle points to be able to check here, what you can get the first time here. So you can get Potion, Flingstone, Shrapnel, Ether, Mimetamines, which is kind of a horn translation by the way, uh, Fury Ring, ooh that's interesting, Enemy Lure, nice, uh, which is nice of course for enemy counts as primitive, Speed Blood Championship Belt is the expensive thing now, uh, because that will become fish fair. But the O ring, that's actually kind of tempting though. So I actually start doing early. Just like that, right? Because, yeah, that's just. The O ring is very nice actually. Because that's just all the O ring is actually worth 5,000 or something like that to, to get and stuff like that. But yeah. Um, so the spins and also, so this has been the. And of course, the speed run. So, but you can cut out the progress we need to be honest, um, and stuff like that, but yeah. I also showed you where you can get a lot of the GP and stuff like that. And you saw there we only pulled the 80 GP ones there, but that's not even the highest GP that you can get. Of course, you can get way higher on this one as well, and stuff like that. But hey, it's really that you need to see the, like, the 100 GP at least. But even if you get the 80 GP and you don't get it very often, the thing is, if you use, for example, the speed up, then you can make that go way faster, otherwise it's just like playing that over and over until you get enough GP and stuff like that. <sighs> and so the 80 GP stuff is rare, but oh yes, also the 100 GP and 150, 300 GP is very rare. But it will eventually just happen, you know, and stuff like that. And once you have enough money, once you have like over a million gill, you know, things won't really matter anyway, you know, and stuff like that. But yeah, but in the next one, basically, which uh, I will see when we record that, right? Because I'm playing so much better than the world, like, I would ever love to just continue to play better than the world for the time to record this, but, but yeah, I did not. <laughs> and of course, I got to collect the savage level better than the world, you have seen thoughts on Twitter. Even though the photo got a bit shaky when I was trying to get the box, because, because, yeah, because it was really, really hard I had to to stand basically with the webcam and stuff like that. I was going to take a picture of it and it's not the best quality or whatever, right? Maybe I could take a better picture of it in the other ones. So that, but uh, I hope you all enjoy this and stuff like that. And uh, the next one we're going to go and be doing, we're going to go to probably Cosmo Canyon right away and stuff like that. And then of course once we've done Cosmo Canyon, there are some decent weapons there in Cosmo Canyon because there are certain times when we are going to want to use the Cosmo Canyon weapons over the over the more redundant or paper weapons and stuff like that. Just because yes you can use the level up you have to level up the material slower to do that, but it is still worth doing and stuff like that. But the main goal is of course to get to Vincent the next one or probably get to see and all that stuff as well but yeah but once we get wins at the course uh, then that's probably when you want to go back because then you can get kids for me